where art thou, sir? Uh, I might be lost. Oh, wait, over here? Oh, there we go. I'm gonna save just in case I mess this up. <laughs> this is the ice one. <laughs> when did you? <laughs> I, I'll see you have reached one of the fields. I just found him lying around here. I just needed to get him real quick. <laughs> I literally kidnapped him. <laughs> if you plant the seeds in this field, ice root carrots will grow. It has been so long that my memory is hazy, but I believe that my loyalty you should have often partaken of this sword's vegetable. If I was care, here's where my steed preferred, it must have been ice time, wasn't it? It's most vexing that I can't recall. I suppose we will see. <laughs> I'll ask but once more, are you sure this is a field in which you want to plant the seeds? Well, you didn't ask me that for a second. Very well, then I asked you plant the seeds. Dig, dig, dig. Yeah, plant those seeds. Pat, pat. <laughs> very good, very good. You have an able hand for working with soil. Now then, it's time I did my part. Let me show you my powers. Crown. Oh my god. What is- oh my- what is this? <laughs> oh my god. What was that music too? It was just saying. <laughs> oh. Just- Doink. Gasp, gasp. You plant so many seeds, and yet my power can only get one to grow. To think that I have fallen so low, it truly breaks my heart. But soon it will be my time to bid my sorrow farewell. Now, human child, I must ask you to pull that ice root care free with all your might. We get a bag of them, but we can't just get both carrots. <laughs> The key item. <laughs> Produce that the king of Rome has loved steed like to eat. Well done, human chat. That carrot will be the key to learn my loyal steed back to me. And now all we need are the reins of, of unity. They will amplify my power, let me ride my loyal steed with ease. But I doubt I shall ever get another set from the humans from the village. <gasps> there he is. Bryce. Bryce Pappenbrook. What, glass carrier? My loyal steed, is it truly you? That glistening white pale, that rough, violent gout. It has not changed from the day we first met. Oh, how this brings back memories. Oh, oh my god, it's dying. It is my belief that while my steed picked up upon the scent of the carrot, it could not determine where the scent was coming from. Idiot. Judging from the direction it ran off, it must be headed to the village in an attempt to pillage carrots there. If that is true, that freezing tent is in danger. Human child, we must make haste. Can I fly there? No. Why? There's a cutscene right outside the village. Or are you gonna teleport me back? You better teleport. Okay. Hey, Axel. <laughs> okay, cool, I can. Oh, hey. My little season and areas are blind too weak. Please, human child, I beg you, save the village. Where is he? It can't be too b oh. What the hell? <laughs> I like it's cry. Stop! Wait! Will these choices matter? Probably not. Bryce! Oh, I didn't know half its face was only covered with ice. Oh god, this music. Will I actually get to hear it, or will I just pyroball it and kill it? Bryce, Happy Brook. Listen, you're blind. You can don't fast ears after your ice carrot. Ice root carrot. I want this guard down. As opposed to every other Pokemon I try to fucking throw a Pokeball at. One, two, three, four. Boom! One shot? Yeah, that thing's a bit bulky. <clears throat> He's doing an Irish jig. Phantom the Horse Opera.
Yeah. I threw a soccer ball in and gave it and headbutted it. Now it feels a lot better. Definitely. That's how that works. <clears throat> burr, burr. The boss music's still going. Is there a part two? My god. <laughs> Nay ice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I mean, he's has a reaction to patrolling. <laughs> Go around. Oh. Oh, thank God. NPC is saved. Are you alright? Yes, uh, I feel like something stepped in to save me. Oh! Is that the rings? How'd they get there? Did they have them on it the entire time? Oh, tough of a white mane here. Oh, God, Fisper, how can I fall asleep? Thank you for saving me the people. I had no idea such a fist Pokemon still exists in a tundra. Why it remind me of that Pokemon in the fairy tales, the loyalty, the king. Ah, oh, but no doubt I am overthinking things. Are you sure about that? Is that tough to white man here? Fairy tales is said that I weaving the hair of I don't think it is, but I'm gonna explain it anyway, just in case. <laughs> That's basically what he's like. <laughs> it's said that by weaving the hair of the loyalty, he together with a radiant blossom going by the king. It's supposed to create the reigns of unity, which is linked to the king with its steed. Ah. In fact it was my own ancestors who used to weave the uh, reigns of unity following an ancient tradition passed down over many generations. Of course, I myself have never seen any kind of flower, and the method of making the reigns is lost of time. In case we can't spend all day musing over fairy tales, I must, I must make plans and preparations that Pokemon can all decide to pay us another visit after all. Thank you very much for the help, kind traveler. This village is full of old people. Meanwhile, he's st still get kidnapped. <laughs> He's just kidnapped. <laughs> I'm just fine with that. I'm just like, fine, whatever. He was too loud anyways. <laughs> you have my thanks for protecting the village, young human child. Were I at my full power, I could have tamed my steed and regained its loyalty. But weakened as I am now, the most I could do was influence it, its will and make it depart. If only I had the rings in unity, that it would have allowed me to tame my steed in short order. They can make a set. What's that? We can, we can find a set of rings with main hair from my loyal steed and a flower that I can grow. A flower. A flower. Yes, but of course. I assumed that the humans stopped making the rings of unity because they had lost their faith in me. But it was because I lost the power to grow the material needed. I spent far too long holding my misguided substance, it seems. Yeah, it's all your fault. <laughs> Good job. You ruined absolutely everything. <laughs> it's been many centuries since I was able to grow a radiant flower. True, so it drains much of my power. But for whatever reason, actually my power seems to have returned to me just now. There's only one thing to do. Let the radiant flower bloom. Bloom. And he's like, oh, it didn't work. Oh, it didn't work. Never mind. <laughs> oh my god. Are you shaking the entire continent? Oh. <laughs> Crown is Bloomus. <laughs> Crown is Bloomus. Take this, human child. Radiant petal. Pan pan. This <laughs> is just that face. It shakes me to admit, but a whole flower is beyond me right now. I do not know if that petal will be enough, but I still must ask that you use it to create the reigns of unity. The descendants of a family who once made the reigns for me should still live in this village. I put my hopes on you, human child. Hi, Alex. 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 Get rid of that new notification. I know it's gonna go away right away, but it'll still bother me if I don't get rid of the new notification before it goes away. <laughs> Tis a sad fate, I believe. Oh, hello again, savior of our village. Come to do some more reading? Not this time. I need a favor. I beg your pardon. You want to make the set of the reigns of the unity? Well, I say, that presents a bit of a problem. If my dear great granddad were still around, he'd have been able to make you a set. But unfortunately, we have no one left who knows the traditional ways of the, at that at this point. What's more, I doubt you have the flower you need to forge to set of the reins. Got a petal at least. 
Is is that a petal from a radiant flower? If so, could that mean the King of Bountiful Harvest is truly? Oh shit! Wasn't that little wasn't that little nerd with the big head? Oh damn it! <laughs> it's like um well, my bad. <clears throat> it has a it won't let it guard down because it has a gun hidden. <laughs> let me see what you have. A knife? No. I'm impressed. I've been streaming this long too. I have. I don't feel drained at all. With a Isle of Armor, I felt really drained, honestly. But this has been a lot more fun with exploration, uh, all the legendaries, new, a lot more new Pokemon than like Isle of Armor just having Kubfu and you having to grind Kubfu like that. It's all ice. <laughs> it's just, there are literally T-Rexes like a mile down the road. <laughs> what was that in, uh, what was that comment for, like in reference to? I kind of forgot. If so, does that mean the came- oh yeah. No, 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 I dare not hope. <clears throat> If I recall, my ancestors made rains of unity by following the ways passed down in fairy tales. There are two key materials, a flower and hairs from a Pokemon. I'm afraid those old traditions have long since faded from memory. You've are, uh, you said that like three times already, I swear. Still, how can I use a favor from such a kind and helpful guest? The materials, if you please. The white ice. <laughs> the little ice. The little ice. We've forgotten, but that plot point means Jack because we had time constraints. <laughs> I'm kidding. I can't promise this will turn out as well as the ones my great granddad would have made, but time to breathe life back into the traditions of my village. Character development. Character development gleam. Click clack, click clack. Whir whir. I'm afraid it hasn't come out well at all. I fancy myself crafty enough sort, but I suppose it, it's a craftsman of truly delicate technique to make such fine raids. Oh, please, don't look so dejected. I'm tr very sorry. Like, truly, I am. Wow, I actually am showing emotion? What the heck? Oi, Mr. Man. Did I mention I'm a <laughs> very skilled craftsman? <laughs> the hot water in my shower seats are gone on holiday. Oh, yes, very terribly sorry. I'll have a look at it soon. Oh, you're here too, Chief. Were you in the middle of the sun? The pair of you seem awful gloomy. The mayor tried. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> is that all? <laughs> so all you need to do is make some nice cord. Pass me those materials for a moment. Oh my god, is he actually? Alright, got my pedal, got my hand. Now, what I'm supposed to do with him? <clears throat> if I may be so bold, allow me to share a song that suffice from the legends. Blossom woven round and round, a royal gift and means hair bound. Steady on, old bloke. That's it. It's a bit much. Oh well, that'll, that'll do for an answer. Hiya! Hiya, yeah, yeah, yeah. All finished, have a look. Think this'll do? He actually just- oh my god. He's <laughs> you god. You absolute legend. You're more capable than your face looks on. Those rings are- they are the spinning image of those in my family's tales. Gahahaha. <laughs> I don't sue all my dear re rebellious daughter's clothes for nothing, you know. <laughs> Even the explorer's outfit I gave you was handmade by yours truly, chief. Oh, you mean the one that I wore for like five seconds? <laughs> <laughs> in any case, since you got the rings of unity you need, somehow, isn't that just smashing? How about it, Chief? Has my son saved the day? Absolutely. You beautiful, beautiful man. If I was able to make the rings of unity, surely that tuft of white hair and radiant petal must have been genuine? No, impossible. Perish the thought. Ho ho. Gosh. Oh god, Calyrex, if you just go in there and kidnap- Okay. Well, he's probably gonna show him. Would you believe it? I caught myself falling asleep outside again. <laughs> God damn me. <laughs> Three times in a row today. <laughs> I was chilling to the boat, so I thought I'd warm myself up with a good hot shower and have brace. But the water coming out was ice cold. I got big ultra mega surprise and jumped out. Ooh, I'm possessed. I am as I am ascending. And I am descending. <laughs> Human child, were you able to make ache the rings of unity? You bet. Oh joy, what glorious- Oh, I should've said uh, Peony did it. Because then he'd be like, Oh, I feel really bad for doing this now. <laughs> I have some good news of my own. I was able to track down my loyal steed. Is it- Is, is it the crown giant? Last year I was making home with the- Wait. Yeah, I was there. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I kind of wandered there. <laughs> it was a place where my loyal steed and I spent much time together. I had to avoid the place as I feared I would get trapped in my- in mine own... Is that proper grammar? Probably. I'm just stupid. Nostalgia. Why has my loyal steed made the shrine its home? Is it reminiscing, reminiscing about our time together? No, it can't be. Crown Shrine stands majestically atop the mountain 
to the north. Bring the carrot and ring to so me. Meet me up there. I shall hasten there, but you make a. Oh, you feel you are ready. I am counting on you, child. You're bringing him with you, okay? <laughs> it looks like I fell asleep again, but I have no idea what the fuck I. <laughs> I can't, oh, I can't believe Pokemon this village still live in a Tantra. There are literally T-Rexes and other dinosaurs. <laughs> Old guy related to people who made the rains can't make it. <laughs> Over enthusiastic who has only two songbirds to work off of can make it. <laughs> who has experience just making his daughter's clothes. Ah, well, fly away, fly away, fly away. <laughs> Oh, there you are. I thought that okay. From this angle, I thought that was a buzzwall on the right. <laughs> I was like, is that buzzwall? <laughs> this is very calming music. Miles ruined this calming music with an item theme. Oh, King's Rock, that's fitting. <laughs> This is very pretty music. <clears throat> I've been waiting, human child. Crown Shine is the place I once called home. Last year, uh, <clears throat> must think me helpless now that I have lost my powers. It taunts me by making this place its own dwelling. Ah, I see you have indeed brought me the rings of reunity. You have my thanks, child. Ah, the feeling holdies again. The color, the way they shine in the light. Oh, how this brings back memories. Glass here is a very proud Pokemon. One may even call it arrogant. It will not accept me as its master again unless I am able to prove that my power outweighs its own. I will use the rings of energy to pour my power into it, the very body of my loyal steed. I should convince it that I am still, I am indeed still deserving of its loyalty. Now, human child, in order to lure my loyal steed to me, place the ice cream carrot into the basket near where Glass here has made its bed. Got it. <laughs> I'm short. <laughs> Time has come, and so have I, human child. But you have successfully defeated my uh, loyal steed once already. It will not willingly approach anyone it considers to be a threat. We must hide and wait for it to appear. Oh, oh and then this cutscene. Oh, I think I know what's happening. I remember this cutscene. Wasn't this cutscene in the trailers? Or like you're peeking out with peony? Oh, cutscene! Oh! It hath cometh. Yeah. Yeah, get him. Oh yeah, here that that. <laughs> it's like what? <laughs> what did I wake up to? <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, I could have just master balled it for you and that could have worked too. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah! Oh my gosh. Ice power, baby. Neat. Did he always have that cape? No, I don't think he did. Or maybe I'm stupid. He probably did. <laughs> what in the world? Such a huge noggin. It's got a ride. <laughs> Possess him again. What? It can talk. No. What do you want? Huh, I've got no idea what you're saying, but somehow it also makes sense. Hold us though, what the world are you- Oh no, not again. 
Human child. Thanks to your efforts, I have reunited with my loyal steed. And now I am finally at my full power. I am convinced that the people no longer believed in me, and I, I had also lost my loyal steed. I was trapped in the throes of deep loneliness. But you saved me. There are truly no words with which to fully express my gratitude to you. So I have a suggestion. If you are able to catch me, Catch me even with my powers restored. It will prove your worth beyond my doubt, and I will lend you my strength on your journey. Too bad it's the last DLC. Once you have read, read yourself, come face me. But at first, I should get this man back to where I found him. It would be no good to let him freeze out here in the frigid climate. Huh. <laughs> you he, he did that without even looking. <laughs> Alright, well. Well, look at shit turning his head. Alright, fight me. Crown, crown. Do you want to ready your Pokeballs in order to catch Calyrex? Yes. Do I catch it? Normally? Or do I Master Ball it? I think I'm going to try to catch it normally, but if I need to, I will Master Ball it. Crown. Own. Okay. Let's do this thing. Good thing it's not ice grass. <laughs> Good thing it's using special moves when it's a spe <laughs> physical attacker. <laughs> Good thing it's only 50 big speed. <laughs> but it's very bulky. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, let's go, flinches. But I have. Okay, I deserve that. It got Giga Drain? That's annoying. That's really annoying, actually. <clears throat> you avoid it twice? I hate everything. Oh, here's this. I saw these. Oh, wow. Jesus. Is that like 130 base power? 100% accuracy for no reason. Oh yeah, that's a thing too. It's Ice Psychic, right? So Drain Punch won't actually do so- okay, yeah. Wait, a Glacial Lance hits all Pokemon in the field that's busted. Also, speaking of busted. Hmm. That's not good. Uh, player, player shouldn't kill it, right? It killed it. <clears throat> Good job, cat. <laughs> I have, I had such high defense that I can live with like a lot of HP after a pyro ball. But God forbid I get play roughed. <laughs> that was anticlimactic. Let's do this thing. For real this time. You're gonna get owned. As one. One, two, three, four. Boom. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, you take only like <laughs> you take that much. Oh gosh, this is still. I feel like this might one shot actually, just because of how strong it is. Okay. I wasn't sure. Um, yeah, it spans that but I guess. Um, Pokeball. <laughs> it's just. I don't want to damage it too much, so I'm gonna wait. One. If I caught it there, that would have been an insult to Kabalion. <laughs> Iron defense? Oh, that's not good. Never mind, I think I can start attacking it now. It literally doubled its already monstrous defense, are you kidding me? I could iron hit it, maybe. Yeah, that works. Yeah, that definitely works. <laughs> He's gonna keep iron defensing like that. <clears throat> just a little more. And then I'll just wait till it KOs me. And then Thunder Wave it. Oh, it KO'd me. Cover Girl, make it easy and breezy. Alright, Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave! Uh, I might go to- I should probably go to Ruby. Alright, start to chuck the balls. <clears throat> 
All right, let's go. One, two, three. God damn, so close. Did I ever tell the time that uh, the first time I ever used a Master Ball was in Fire Red Leaf Green? Uh, I forgot which one, but like, uh, I think you said you can catch any Pokemon. So I thought that meant Trainer's Pokemon too. And of all things, I tried to catch a Trainer's Coughing. I think it was on the route on the way to Viridian, uh, not Viridian, um, what's the Safari, Safari Zone City? On the way there, like that one L-shaped uh, route. And I used it against one of the, like, uh, trainers there who had coughing, and I'm like, oh, I want to do that, and then it got thrown off. I'm like, oh, well. <laughs> not Saffron, is it? No, that's, no, Saffron's Fuchsia, right? I can't false swipe it? Why not? Oh, wait. Oh, you mean for the other horse. Oh, okay. I thought you meant, <laughs> I don't, that was the last thing I read, so I'm like, wait, is it gonna be like, I quit after having one HP? That's unfair. <laughs> How much is this gonna do, though? I wonder. Well, we lived it, so that's good. Dang it. Die already! The ghost one has such a limited moveset, like, its only coverage is... Mudshot. The ice horse is probably better by itself. Calyrex with the, a ghost horse is probably better than the, ice ho than the ice one, but the ice one is still good. Especially since it learns Trick Room itself, so it's just like, I set my own Trick Room, and then I kill you. Two? No. One. He keeps trying to do Iron Defense, he's just like, I want to raise my defense even higher than five million. One. That was wild. <laughs> All right, one, two, no. He's trying to do that iron defense. One, two, three, got him. Calyrex was caught along with last year, but no one cares about last year. Only Calyrex matters. <laughs> they said that this Pokemon once moved a large forest of the Pokemon living there to a new location overnight. The hiking Pokemon. <laughs> it's a hiker. <laughs> Hikes on its horse. Nice. Let's go. Human child. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume he's all the way over there in the town and saying this. <laughs> Human child? No, I should refer to you by your human name now. Jacob. I look forward to what adventures we might have together. Oh. <laughs> I think he was doing he was doing it through Rotom, I think? Maybe? Like Peony through Rotom? I don't know. Hello. <clears throat> Hello, that you Chief, it's me, Peony. I just had a dream about a big headed Pokemon talking on and on in a weird shrine. You were there too, Chief, if it all felt so real. I got worried about you and I decided I'd give you a call back and check it. You haven't hurt yourself, have you, Chief? Not in a bunch of trouble, are you? Everything's under control. <laughs> ah, good to hear, because I got nothing to worry about then. Ga ha ha ha. The Peony Exploration Team is all about the safety and well-being of its members, after all. So you can be careful on your way back, too, you hear? No exhibition's over until you're safe and sound back at home base. Ga ha ha ha. Calyrex, the King of Bountiful Harvest, was able to reconnect with its loyal steeds in the new reigns of unity. Calyrex also seems to have regained its trust in humankind. All, th uh, all thanks to me, a 12-year-old child. As thanks for helping its regain its power, Calyrex allowed me to take it along on my adventure. And then we're going to separate it, because I need it for my living decks. <laughs> I'm glad I got that without the Master Ball. Sans horse, sans horse. Ba -da -ba -ba. I almost ran away from where I need to go. Oi, Chief! Wait, you really caught Calyrex from the Legends? That's Ultra Mega Brilliant, report away. That, 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 that Huggins massive. Is that the King of will Harvest, the one calling the shots around here? Huh, I could swear I've seen it before. Or then again, maybe not. Yeah, it's only, I've only been possessed like four or five times. Anyway, it's definitely regal of it to have a steed, and the massive head does sort of resemble a crown. It's kingly enough at any rate, let's call this a successful expedition. Looks like you all sorted out there is to report on legendary clue one of the King of Bountiful Harvest. Smash it, I'll mark this expedition done. Counter, oh, oh wait. <laughs> 
<laughs> check mark. You need to give me his highlighter check mark. Looks like a as all about the report. You've got the report just about now. Go give the, those other legends a nice throw of this game. Oh, oh wait, you're done. <laughs> huh? Well, how about that, Chief? Looks like it was a, <clears throat> the last bit of the Grand Peony Inventor that I had for you. Ooh, now that is an occasion. What's the word? Ultra Mega Epic. Your passion for this all caught me off guard, Chief. This whole Inventor or thing was built out of a land load of rubbish I scrapped. <clears throat> I scraped together. Even I had my dance about the whole thing. But you, you went all the way, ton of energy. You don't suppose those Pokemon you call are, are really the ones in Legends, do you? I do. Nah, actually, never mind. You don't have to tell me anything. A look on your face tells me everything I need to know, Chief. I can tell that you must have done some ultra and mega epic exploring. And whatever you discovered on your way, that's a special treasure just for you. I'm not about to rain on your parade by being nosy and asking silly questions. Well, Chief Jacob, thanks for sticking around and finishing every part of my inventor. I want you to have this. Consider it my way of saying thank you. Oh, cool. Hmm, but I can't shake the feeling I'm forgetting something. Oh yeah, your daughter. Uh, d uh, dad, I people can hear you all the way outside, you know. My darling, Nia. Huh? This place isn't bad. So this is where you're staying. Oh, uh, hey, Jacob. Fancy meeting you here outside the Max Lair for once. Yeah, it's been a while. Not really. Heh. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> you really are my wavelengths. Like totally. So, so you actually kept my old man company? Cheers, I owe you one. I've had my fill of a Dynamax adventures now. So I ought to may as well try one of those, what do you call it, tours my old man was going on about. Oh, oh. Uh, what? Why'd everyone suddenly go, <laughs> I'm her, I'm his new child. <laughs> oh, hold on, give me just a moment. I'll go with some new legend straight away. You have your adventure, Nia. A nice father-daughter ex ex expedition, finally. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. You'll come up with legends? Oh, that's way too close. I need some personal space here. Right. First things first. I've got something for you, Nia. Here. I made this brilliantly shiny explorer outfit for you. You can get you if you want to come up with something. What in the world? Are you trying to turn me into a disco ball of something? And she took it anyway. Why? Why have to... Why have I got to wear this golden one when yours is normal? Gah, isn't it obvious? You're my darling dog. Yeah. I want you to shine so bright that everyone notices you. Gah, it's things like this. I've changed my mind. Here, you can have this. <laughs> and what, what, why? His pose. Is he a JoJo character? I'm, he I'm heading back to my own adventure, trying to catch some more Dynamax Pokemon. No, come back, Nia. No need to be so rebellious. I know you really love me, don't you? Ah, so <clears throat> ah, sorry for the sudden commotion, Chief. I, it was a blast exploring with you. You're free to keep using it our base camp, of course. Anyway, time for me to go spend some quality time with my darling daughter. Hold on, Nia, away from me. My god. And then the end? Oh my gosh. The end. <laughs> Cute. His theme. <laughs> Alright. Oh, what's this? A legendary clue? He seems to draw. There's a photo attached to it showing a shining ho- Oh, is this for Necrozma? Probably. Oh, yeah, that's definitely for ne That's an Ultra Wormhole. <laughs> and that's Necrozma in the Ultra Wormhole. <laughs> So he just comes up with this shit, along with pictures. <laughs> if you somehow found it, nice. <laughs> let me get that. Let me get the nebby. The nebby. <clears throat> yeah, give me Foofy. Look at him. It has a healing room. Oh, okay. Well, I went all the way over here for nothing, man. <laughs> I've been doing that the entire stream. Oh, lead card. Oh, I. I don't think I've ever pressed this before. <clears throat> oh yeah, this is my. <laughs> hey Leon. <laughs> P.A. is a former Steel type gym leader. His powerful and dynamic battle style meant that 
Uh, anyone stuck on pitch maintenance had their work cut out for them. To this day, he is known as Steel Peony and in many, <clears throat> has many fans, especially among men. Uh, this photo is actually a composite photo made before Peony came to the Crown Tundra. It was originally a poster Peony stuck in the travel planner he made for his daughter, but he, she threw it away in short order. Peony liked the way it looked and decided to use it for his trainer card. Nice. Though it, this is a sudden <clears throat> addressed publicly, Peony is in fact Rose's younger brother. I knew it. <laughs> Peony is compared to his brilliant older brother since he was born, causing him to gradually rebel and become a delinquent. Aww. <laughs> uh, he eventually ran away from home only to become a gym leader once his talent was recognized. He was even champion. <clears throat> oh, he was also champion? Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. Rose was also champion, right? I forgot. He was even champion once, but shortly afterward, uh, uh, Rose became league chairman. This caused Peony to vanish entirely from the league. The Caparaja of Peony's team has been there since it was a cuff, uh, Q-Fent. It was the first Pokemon Peony caught together with his brother. Aw. There's a little Mia. Oh yeah, there's a exclamation mark there, I think. Oh wait, I probably have to go in. That's probably what it means. Lunala. Oh, okay. Talk to him. Hey there, Chief. Thanks for stopping by. I'm finally getting in a little quality family time with my darling Mia. <laughs> She's just like, I'm done with everything. Hmm, I dropped something at base camp. Is that really mine? I don't recall ever writing it. Hang on, isn't that the max layer there in that clue? Wow. Huh? Oh gosh. What happened? They let children in here? I mean, I guess I am a child too, but that's like an eight-year-old. <laughs> creatures, a whole a horde of uh, creatures appeared, and we don't know if they're Pokemon. Oh, Ultra Beast. Okay, I see. It's something caused alien beings to appear. It's somehow connected to that Ultra bitch. <laughs> huh, I wonder. Well, like, can I put two and two together? Hmm? That sounds like some new crazy things afoot. You know what that means, Steve. But <laughs> you a new expedition's approaching. And I know just what to call this one. Oh, no. They came from the ultra beyond. I guess we're, I guess the stream isn't coming to an end soon. <laughs> I'm glad you like that one, Chief. Anyway, for now, here's the goal. Catch the Pokemon or whatever in the photo on that odd clip. <clears throat> Is the next one I do always Necrozma? I guess I gotta do this first. All right, so who, who is this thing? Record tree? Thunderous. So glad my eardrums get literally broken every time one of, one of these things appear. Now we're done. Yeah. Oh well. That's what happens when you get useless Pokemon. I mean, I picked the Basculin, but the Basculin is actually doing a lot of damage. Alright, now we're ready to battle Peony. Which I'm probably going to just two-shot him, probably, if I were to guess. <laughs> let's battle. Alright, let's go around there. Get me Ultra Mega ready, Chief. You bet. Yeah! I love Peony. <laughs> Herzerker? Oh, he's got five Pokemon. Definitely like steel types like his brother. Ah, d, d is watching from the sidelines. Time to activate coolest dad ever mode. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Play soccer with him five times. One shot all his Pokemon and go! Look at you showing how it's done. Expect none less from you, Chief. Still calling me Chief. Well, I guess it's still working. RuneScape. RuneScape. Oh. <clears throat> Stone Age. Alright. It's a quick hood. Oh yeah, I fr he did this exact same thing in our ma the first match. <laughs> I switched to the Stone Edge and then he's like, I'm gonna crunch you. I'm like, oh, fair enough. <laughs> and my mind gets big because now his sturdy's going away. Again, like, yeah, I'm so smart. I knew that. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> wow. Go into my little hidey hole. 
attack from behind. Nah, it's not good. Shadow Ball. Yikes. <clears throat> I'll give everyone a shot. I haven't used Chuckster at all. <clears throat> uh, would be tough, but you know, let's do it. I feel bad for not using the little guy. He helped us with Kabalion, and then I've just been using everyone else. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's go. Wild Charge. Nice. Almost there. Extra Sensory. Oh, that has a chance to flinch, right? Please don't flinch me. There we go. <clears throat> Cop Raja. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna do ball. <laughs> uh, what if I bring my own? Oh, yeah, so- Ooh, never mind, I made a terrible mistake. Woo! Well, his defense is lowered, so if I'm faster than it... This Earthquake is probably going to kill. Especially with Life Orb. Nice. And the crit help too. Don't let your guard down now. I've still got a thrashing left to give. Scizor. Ooh. No, well, I got fire, but. I'm dumb. And we'll go with it anyway. <laughs> I was like, oh, can I get someone else? I'm like, no, nah, I think I really feel comfortable with Axel going out. <laughs> It's all off. Yeah, tank that like a champ. Fire type's got a lot, like, pure fire's got a lot of resistances. It's like five. Bog, steel, fairy, grass. It's like technician boosted wing attack, oh god. Kill him. Burn, baby. <laughs> gone and gone and got stronger again, have you? Oh wait, gone and gone stronger again, haven't you? Oh well, hats off to you in more ways than one. He's so scared. He's like a cute anime girl. Gaha, <laughs> <laughs> that's why you're the chief, chief. My strong Pokemon you got. Kamaraja and the rest as look ultra mega pleased that they got a chance to cut them loose too. I just keep fighting you. Whoa. <laughs> Grind. I guess it's a good grinding spot. Beep, beep, beep. Jacob, at last. Hello, hello, you there. This is Jacob's Rotom phone, right? Ah, stop for your number. I'm glad he didn't pull anything funny like giving me the wrong one. Oh, sorry, I guess I should say who was calling you, eh? Oh. Oh, God, it's Leon. It's me, Leon. Sorry, I, <laughs> I, I took you aback. Rusty sure there can only be one, a pretty good reason for me to call you out of the blue like this. Oh, yeah, the thing. The former champion of Galar has a favor to ask of the current champion, and that to you, Jacob. Come on over to Windon Stadium and I'll tell you all the details. I've heard it that way myself now, and I, I swear I won't take any detours or get lost. I forgot about that. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess that's that, then. I think I am probably going to end it right now. <laughs>